So what we were doing yesterday. The social welfare surcharge. We were talking about social welfare surcharge. Okay. So 110 of the Finance Act 2018. And there was a doubt which I got cleared today. And this is uh, the replacement. What we were reading yesterday. The Customs Import of Goods as Concessional Rate of Duty Rules 2017. Now we have new rules. The Customs Import of Goods at Concessional Rate of Duty or for a specific end use. These are new words added and these are new rules 2022. Okay, so this is a completely complete replacement. <clears throat> I'll take you back to 118. Yeah, this is here. So this we discussed in the 110 section we have talked about in detail. The confusion was here. Notification number 13 or 28, this says, exempt so social welfare surcharge on IGST and GST. Now here is the text of that, text of the notification. So whatever doubt we had yesterday, this is clarified here. This is an exercise of the powers conferred by subsection one of section 25. So this is power to allow the exemptions by way of notification, right? The customs act read with section 110 of the finance act. So this is what we are reading. The central government being satisfied that it is necessary in the public interest so to do it hereby exempts. So this is exemption. The goods is specified in the first schedule. First schedule means in relation to import. When imported into India from whole of the social welfare surcharge levyable on IG integrated tax under subsection 7 and good GST compensation says under subsection 9 of section 3 of the said act. Right. So exemption has been given only to IGST and GST. Right. This is not saying, so this blue is a note which is very important to note that this exemption does not apply to additional custom duty as well as special additional custom duty chargeable under section 3.1 and 3.5 of the customs tariff act. IGST chargeable under section <clears throat> 7. 3.7. Seven. Seven. Right? Compensation says a chargeable under section 3, subsection 9 of the IGA of the Customs Tariff Act. Okay. So this exemption is very, very specific. It is not saying that it is not chargeable in the due on the custom duties levyable under section 3 of the Customs Tariff Act. It is saying no. It is saying that full exemption is there for the goods imported from duty under section 3.7 and, and compensation says under section 3.9. It means the goods of which are not subject to GST. Listen carefully. Now, the goods which are not subject to GST, if those are imported, what will happen? There will be ACD and special ACD. And social welfare surcharge will be calculated on that. To watch full video, join online batch weekdays, 8.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. Call Tail Institute.